reclaim your dignity. Reclaim your dignity. <laughs> yep. Sorry, too late. You're already fucking using a stick on your asshole. Yeah, personal matters. Oh. Uh, uh, Bill in Jersey, what do you got, buddy? Hey, how's it oh, going? Bill. Uh, the worst part of the hover round commercial is the guy, the inventor. His name is Tom Cruise. Oh, yeah, Tom like, Cruise. Around the dumb chair. I'm Tom Cruise, inventor of the hover round. Really? It's spelled different, though. Oh, it is? Yeah, like coffee. Only spelled. <laughs> All right. Slap chop, yeah. The clapper. And the eye. <laughs> <laughs> John Coffey. Clapper is actually high end shit. Yeah, where that... that actually worked. And it did make stuff a little more convenient. Yeah. The, uh, the old people shit, though. The, and I, I wish I could remember the shoehorn thing. I can't. With I Gilbert. Because it, it's people that can't get their shoes on or, or off. It's like, you can't put your fucking shoes on or off. And you could even do it with your laces tied. You can tie your fucking laces. You just give up on life. Yeah, don't give you up get, on those. You get, you get like the Velcro shoes at that point. Uh, uh, Dude, yeah. when I got to drive myself to the kitchen and I have on those Velcro shoes, I'm going right down the stairs. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the Shudini. The Shudini. They have to have a clever name. Yes, thank you. The Shudini. Uh, it, it's called the Shudini. Mm -hmm. So you, you, uh, the commercial, yeah. Bending over to put your shoes Listen on is a backbreaking chore. One wrong step, you could end up on the floor. And trying to get them off can hurt even more. Well, now the Shudini, the world's first shoe horn that lets you get your shoes on and off with ease. Shudini has a telescoping handle that gives you the reach you need. Dude, so you instant can millionaire. slip your shoes I know. On without bending over. And unlike Yo, regular cunt. shoe horns, Shudini <laughs> has a patented grip clip that patented. holds your shoe in place while you take it off. Just slide it in and patented. slip them off. Shudini so, works with all your shoes. You can even cunt. use them on sneakers. And just look how easy it is to put on and take off dress shoes, even when they're laced up. No more wrinkled clothes trying to get your shoes on. No more scuffing and <laughs> Damaging your shoes, trying to <laughs> get them off. The Shudini is perfect for anyone with arthritis Why is she or holding back a pussy? pain. Especially <laughs> with limited mobility. Plus, the grip clip lets you pick up your shoes off the floor without bending over. So stop you never bending have to and bend over again. With your this shoes is genius. Every day it really is. That really is. I kind of like this one. Get Shudini <laughs> right here. Right right hey, dude, Gilbert Reed is a fucking it's not just a phenomenal. Shoe horn, it's a oh, yeah. shoehorn. Crazy. So call now and it's get your shooting for just. just. I would love to hear his stick. outtakes. Receive our oh, shooting with yes. the one pass clear Because you know he's just shirt. goofing on it. Maybe, Anthony, you can invest in about this called Judini. <laughs> like it helps you identify Jews. <laughs> Makes them disappear like Houdini did. <laughs> I didn't want to say that. I just not uh, identify oh, oh, okay. <laughs> so I, I came up with a different name that I won't use. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is a good yes. point coming in from Josh in Boston. Josh. What's going on, guys? Hey, man. Hey, uh, I just want to know why Bill Burr's talking shit when didn't he fall for the sham wow? You did fall for the sham wow, Bill. Oh yeah, no, you I'm brought not that to I, our show. I've never said that I'm a smart guy. Did you buy the sham wow? Yeah, this is this. And up, you hated it, right? Yeah, but I was actually wrong. It does work. You have to get it wet first. Yeah, that's the problem. But, but and then is, ring it out. There yeah, are but, but there then, are Gilbert Gottfried outtakes from that on a, a website. No um, way. Awfulcommercials.com. Well, why you guys are looking that up? The thing, but the thing about the sham wow is because you have to get it wet. This space is never totally dry, so it basically soaks up like you know. Hmm. It, it's still bullshit. It's it, still it, bullshit. A but I was chamois a little... though works when you wash a car, <clears throat> and then you want to get the beads of water off. You you, you get it damp. You wring the fucker out, and then you can get the little spots up without streaking your car. I've seen them work, and and all the sham wow is is a fucking chamois. That's it. Is this uh, are these the outtakes? Dude, I bought a lot. I bought this. I bought the set it and forget it. That was great. You throw a whole chicken in there. Wait, wait. It's not the set it forget it. It's the set it and forget, forget it. it. <laughs> you gotta be excited. Oh, that was such a great idea. You know, just turn on some machine like you know, four hundred degrees. And just forget about it. Just walk away. <laughs> That's the Showtime rotisserie. Idea. Yeah, Showtime rotisserie. <laughs> oh, and that Bron thing was Pope the shit. doing it himself. Yeah. The commercial. That, so, I, I remember. Uh, Back in the day where I, I would wake up at like 8 p.m. and go to sleep at like 6 in the morning. Like some yeah. of my favorite shows were infomercials because that's kind of all that was on. I watch them all the time. I used to get so excited like when the Banjo Minnow commercial would come on. I'd be like, oh, this is a good one. And I'd sit there and I'd watch it for an hour. What a fucking fishing lore. <laughs> and, and the Pocket Fisherman, when he came out with that one, and they show the guy just driving down the road. 
And he looks over, and there's a creek next to him, and he goes, Ma! Opens up his glove compartment, and he's fucking fishing. He's just fishing. Yeah, it doesn't get ripped out of your hand. No, it doesn't stink like fish in his glove compartment. It's just <laughs> clean as a whistle. Uh, are these the uh, are right, these are the outtakes? I guess. Yeah, let's uh, let's give a listen. How many of you have said I can never get my shoes on and off by myself? Please help me. Well, all right. This is new shoe Dini, the world's first shoe horn on a stick. And just look how easy it is to put on and take off dress shoes, loafers, sneakers, sandals, like or shoes week. with straps. Yeah. Yes, but does it have a hook at the end? Absolutely it has a hook. Pick up your shoes off the floor without bending over. With Shudini, it's no more scuffing and damaging your shoes. Get Shudini right any, uh, this, I can hear this all is you genius. screaming right Here's now. Here's what this Wait, is. I this is a site oh, by yeah. the commercial companies yes. to get assholes to watch the to entire watch commercial. The commercial again, <laughs> and it works. I refuse to listen. Wait, to the there's, rest. there's still time left. Maybe he starts he cursing at the end of it. <laughs> right this second, I can hear all of you screaming right now. Wait, I'm still ordering the spray-on hair. Come on, no, no, just get the shoe horn. Cause what use is having hair if you don't have shoes? That's why you need Shudini. It's not just a shoe horn. It's a shoe horn on a stick. Yeah, a perfect really read. Cool. Yeah. I got, I got one. I got one. I shouldn't even say this on the air. We can make a fortune off of this. You saying the pocket fisherman? Yeah. The pocket telescope. And then you make it, and it's really for fucking perverts, but you make it seem like they, they want to bird watch. Yeah, they want to yeah. look at planets. So they just show people how difficult it is to use a real one. They're poking themselves in the Ow. eye. Then you got people driving down the street, and they're able to, oh, wow, you know, hey. pull over with their kid and look at the moon. Look at Venus. Yeah, and what you really is, it's a way to be a pervert without, without your neighbors knowing. Fucking look through the windows of neighbors' houses. Yeah, I'm still on that little vibrator thing. It's not a massage thing. It's a, it's no, a, it's it's a vibrator. The stars and yeah, not to look at the, the neighbors. Pocket pervert. <laughs> the pocket pervert. Oh, these glasses. Yeah, you just reminded me of the HD wraparounds. Oh yeah. Clip-ons let light shine right in from the sides and prescription sunglasses. I remember Amber Vision. Oh, and blue blockers. Solution. Everything is so much crisper and clearer. It's amazing. sunglasses that wrap around oh, great. Your prescription lenses, and they feature our unique HD vision. Oh, that's great! You look like Ace from Casino. <laughs> Ace is high. HD lenses enhance your vision. HD vision. Isn't life in HD better be? I think your eyes see in high definition. The colors, everything's just so vivid. It makes things seem almost brighter. Actually, well, H HD is clearer than so real life. Clear. It is. These yeah. glasses look like really designed sunglasses, and they can start. Do they look like designer <laughs> sunglasses? They look like the 3D specs. Are amazing. HD vision wraparounds have oh, a modern European specs. styling that 